Fifteen years ago, there was a war. Well, war has broken out here plenty of times before. They've tried to invade the Southlands through the Northern Valley time and time again. Luck was never on their side, though, and their victories didn't last long. They didn't realize that times had changed. Facing one defeat after another, losing territory and watching their nation dwindle, they built up their industrial strength to unprecedented heights and used it to wage one final battle against the world. That was 15 years ago. They fought ferociously, but were utterly defeated. The Belkins then committed the unthinkable. They used nuclear weapons on their own soil. Seeing this tragedy unfold before their own eyes, the victorious countries vowed to throw down their weapons. The world was once again at peace. And thanks to them, it seemed it would last forever. On a distant island, far away from civilization, the protectors of the peace take to the skies. Red alert! I was in the sky, trying to get the training team in my viewfinder from the rear seat of the lead plane. My pilot in the front seat was howling at the earth below. Sorry about this. The captain's apology to me seemed misplaced. One instructor had survived the fight but crashed on landing. The other one was killed in action high up in the clouds. It wasn't his fault that the unidentified aircraft fired on us without warning. Nor was it his fault that the low altitude area where he sent his trainees was directly in front of the enemy. Eight people died because the command room had misplaced some zeros. That pilot in the number seven was amazing. Did you see her fight back? I couldn't bear to watch. Nagase, you keep flying like that and you'll die real soon. I won't die, sir. The only surviving trainee's voice was almost a whisper. Are you sure? You look like you couldn't hurt a fly. Her face was pale, but she still managed to smile a bit for the camera. The photo, along with my camera, was confiscated by base security. It was as if our little undeclared war never happened. I came to cover this remote island because I heard that a very unique squadron leader was stationed here. I didn't realize he was this unique, though. This bad-mouthed, good-natured old firebrand could take the greenest of rookies and forge him into a fearsome fighter pilot. Of course, that possibility vanished with today's encounter. The only crew he had left now were Second Lieutenant Nagase and the few pilots that happened to be on the ground that day. <clears throat> I know you don't like this, but we're short on people. Starting tomorrow, all you nuggets are going to be sitting alert. If we launch, stay glued to me up there. Nagase? Sir? You're flying number two on my wing. 
Gotta keep an eye on you, or who knows what you'll get yourself into. At ease, people! But don't get too comfortable. It's a grave situation for all of us right now. Let's get this... This is Heartbreak One of War Dog Squadron. We are approaching the target. This is AWACS, call sign Thunderhead. Roger. Bring the target to the ground. Do not fire at the target. Repeat. Do not fire at the target. You got that, Nuggets? Wardog 2, roger. Wardog 3, roger. Wardog 4, hello? Can you hear me, kid? You better be marking our tail, son. Looks like you're confident, at least. Don't get separated from me. Man, I'm glad you drew the short straw instead of me. Second Lieutenant Alvin H. Davenport. Sip it. You need a nickname, too? I respectfully ask to be called Chopper, sir. I'm afraid I may not be able to respond to any other moniker. That does fit you well. I've got a better name for you, but I'll keep it to myself. Okay? Ah, oh, cut me some slack, man. Tally-o, we've got company. Let's go. You're forbidden to fire until I give permission, understand? Good boy. All right, where's Motormouth Chopper? What? That's your name for me? You got a knack for comic dialogue. You mind sending a surrender request for me? Oh no, please! Age before beauty! I'm real shy around strangers, you know. Sheesh. Testing, testing. Attention, unidentified aircraft. Set your course for our beacon immediately. Good. Uh, we will direct you to the nearest airfield. Lower your gear if you understand. Speed bogeys inbound. Approaching unknown aircraft bearing 280, altitude 6000. Hold your fire until further orders. Crossing the pond to fly cover for their spy plane, huh? Now there's a fighter pilot worth his wings. Enemy inbound bearing 280, head on. You're not to fire until I say it's okay, got me? Good boy. Engaging! 
We're gonna shoot them all down, kid. You mind if I grab this kill? I will, you know. Go ahead. War Dog Squadron, weapons safe. Hold your fire until further orders. Turning to engage bandits. We're all in the same piece of sky, but we can never see each other eye to eye. Don't let him get away! Aim straight! Hold your fire! My only regret is not being able to fly with a captain with a sunnier disposition. I feel like I'm the only one being targeted. You talk too much, that's why. You're the only one they hear. War Dog, I ordered weapons safe for all aircraft. Follow orders and hold your fire. Do not fire at the target. Repeat, do not fire at the target. If you need help, ask for it sooner than later. Enemy recon plane down. Aw, oh, what a shame. Too tired to party? Whoa! Those guys are really mad now! Watch your six. Remember the fundamentals and don't get too creative out there. Got incoming enemy missiles, check your radar. They should appear on screen. Wow, never seen an aircraft without any markings before. Good, good, nicely done, Chopper. We're still in this. You might get another serving soon. Nice, I guess you're somewhat useful after all. Heartbreak one to all planes. Is everything functioning normally? Good. Let's go. Damn! Dogfighting sucks, man! My senses are all numb. I don't even have time to be afraid. Chopper, box two! All unknown bogey aircraft destroyed. This is your captain. Can you hear my voice? Kid, what's wrong? You all alive? All right. Nice work, Nuggets. War Dog 4, you still following us? Well, to commemorate the fact that we all made it out of that battle alive, I'm gonna let you keep your nickname. From now on, I'm gonna call you Kid, no matter what. Got it? Good. Man, I swear. Emergency transmission from Central. The whole affair with the unidentified aircraft was covered up. There was even a rumor going around that it was actually a UFO. Officially, the world was still at peace. Having witnessed the battle myself, I wasn't allowed to leave the island. Why do they even bother reprimanding me anymore? I know I'm going to be stuck at Captain forever. Who do you think's covering up the battle? Listen. The only thing across that ocean is Murska Air Base. That's Yuktabanian territory. But haven't we been allies with the Yukes since the war 15 years ago? Yeah. That's why we got people working their asses off trying to confirm what the hell's going on over there. I bet they've got hotlines ringing off the hook somewhere upstairs. The government doesn't want to get the public riled up with all this, you know? But it doesn't matter. Soldiers like us are too stupid to think for ourselves, so we just gotta keep our mouths shut when they tell us to. I feel kind of bad for you, actually. <laughs> it's all right. I get to be with you guys. Captain's probably hating this more than anybody. Hmm? He used to have a lady friend over in Yuktabania. Ah, uh, that's just an old war wound now. Thank you. 
A ship of unknown origin has been detected approaching the Sand Island coastline. We've confirmed that this ship has launched numerous unmanned aerial vehicles probably used for reconnaissance. The UAV will likely return to the launch ship for retrieval after completing their spy operations. You are to halt this operation by intercepting and destroying these recon drones before they can be recovered by the ship. However, do not attack the ship until further orders are transmitted. Wardog, this is Thunderhead. Unmanned recon drones returning to spy vessel. Shoot them down before they get back to the ship. Sure thing. You got that, gang? All right, let's go. Show me what you've got, kid. Our orders are to not fire on the ship, understood? Good. Aim only for the recon planes. How you doing, kid? Pretty easy, huh? Okay, let's hurry up and finish this. Are those drones remote controlled? First the spy plane, then drones, huh? Guess this is a good time to have a little competition of kill scores! I'm glad there aren't any live people in these things, aren't you? So we can just shoot them down and not worry about it. Other recon crafts have probably reached the mainland too. I sure hope not. You better not get sloppy just because they're unmanned drones. They sure use some funky evasive maneuvers. Warning, multiple bogies inbound, closing fast. Same attack axis as before? 280, same vector as last time. Jeez, how many planes they got lined up at the border? We've only got four on our side. We'd better abort. This way. Think you can stick to my tail? Good boy. Trail position today, rock and roller? Hold on, I'll clear your six o'clock for you. Damn it! Why'd I have to draw the short straw today? Everyone else, quit gawking and start shooting. Don't worry, just remember your training. Captain Bartlett! Enemy fire confirmed. Turning to engage. Edge engaging. Heartbreak one engaging. Chopper, engaging! Wardog, you are not cleared to engage at this time! We're gonna shoot them all down, kid. Break right. Landed on the captain's tail. I'm on it. All right, not bad. Enemy squadron has commenced counterattack. You splashed an enemy without permission to engage? What are you thinking, Wardog? Are they here to get back at us for those drones, or what? Secure the local airspace until retrieval is complete. Where'd they come from? Are they with that other group we ran into? Are these the only ones that made it back? Concentrate your attack on the one straggling aircraft. Damn it, kid! Hurry up and help me out here! 
Picture clear. All hostile aircraft are destroyed. Warning still in effect. Keep your heads on a swivel. Watch out, Nagasei. They're down below us, too. The reconnaissance UAV and the unidentified fighter aircraft that bounced us during the mission have been shot down. The country of origin of the ship is still unknown, but it has ceased operations in our maritime defense zone and has departed the area. Once we sanitize our coastal waters, we will conduct a search and rescue mission to find Captain Bartlett, who was shot down. Furthermore, the Union of... This was the room, or the cell, I had been assigned to. Captain Hamilton. Unlike his superior, the base commander who locked me in here, he's been very reasonable with me. He even got my camera back. He told me that if his uncle wasn't a soldier, he would have liked to have a job like mine. Well, we don't have any reason to hold you anymore. What do you mean? Yuktobania just declared war. They've launched an offensive simultaneously, too. Our naval port at St. Hewlett is getting bombed right now. There were only three of them now. circumstances, I'll be issuing an emergency in-flight briefing. Our naval base at St. Hewlett reports that Yuktobanian aircraft have launched a surprise attack on the port. The situation there is critical with widespread panic. Ships from the 3rd Ocean Naval Fleet docked at the port are currently under attack and taking heavy losses. Hurry to Port St. Hewlett and provide air cover for our naval vessels attempting to escape the bay. Among these ships is the aircraft carrier Kestrel. It is the flagship of the 3rd Naval Fleet and a critical combat asset. You must protect the Kestrel at all costs. Engaging next enemy formation. Give me a position. 
This is the AA Cruiser Excalibur. The ship blocking us up ahead. You've got to move away. We can't use our spy radar. Clear to engage. Please engage. Edge engaging. Chopper engaging. I'll cover your six. All right, Blaze? Blaze, you take the lead. I'll go trail and follow. The tanker next to us just exploded! Where's the fireboat? It's spreading to our ship! Help us! Nobody saw them coming? Their ships are just sitting in anchor. This is like target practice. Enemy reinforcements detected. Heads up and get ready. Captain, do you know how to give your commands? I'm ready for him any time, so just say the word. The fireboat got caught in the explosion! Two, no, three ships are burning now! This is not a drill. Oh, thanks for the heads up, you idiot! Your target is the enemy aircraft carrier and the large surface combatants surrounding it. Don't let them escape the port. Sink them all. Protect the Kestrel at all costs! It's time for our Aegis ship to live up to its name. Thanks, everyone. We request your cover until we break out of the port. Damn it! Our whole fleet sinking! Blaze, this is Edge. Have you located the carrier Kestrel? I picked it up as well. Looks like it's still all right. The entire gulf is in flames! Man, what happened here? This is worse than even I imagined. This is the port captain. All vessels leave port immediately. Ships nearest to the exit first. I don't care if we take hull damage. We're clearing out of here any way we can. Starting to cook off. Escape the port and take evasive action. No mistakes. The fire's spreading. We're losing control. This is the aircraft carrier Kestrel approaching port exit. Roger, Kestrel. The Kestrel takes top priority. That barge over there, move it. I know you want out of here, but open up a path. That carrier is valuable. The Kestrel is in open waters. Full voyage, guys. All friendly aircraft, protect the Kestrel for us. This is Swordsman, on my way. That's our ship. Negative. This is AWACS Thunderhead. Swordsman, remain in the eastern sector. Protect our territory and continue battle. But that's my carrier. War Dog, provide cover for the Kestrel. Damn it, you pig-headed! All right, I'm counting on you, War Dog. Don't lose our ship. Hey, Wax, Bogey Dope, give me a target. Bogey's inbound from Vector 280. It's no use, there's too many of them. Get a hold of yourself, your radar control is critical. I'm abandoning ship, we're sitting ducks over here. Come back here, you coward! Is he trying to kill us? What kind of captain is that? Range to bay exit, three miles. War Dog, this is Thunderhead. We need you to take care of the Kestrel. Good. We're counting on you, War Dog. Don't take your eyes off the Kestrel. Hurry up and drop the lifeboats. What are you doing? Hurry up and get out of here! This is it! It's over! Man, this is the worst day of my life! The ships are finally starting to move. Get out of the Gulf! Fast! A flight, engage the enemy ships. B flight, attack and destroy the Gulf board facilities. Oh no! C flight, fly top cover. Establish air superiority. You got that? Roger, commencing attack. Enemy attack! Return fire! Calm down. Just calm down. Enemy anti-ship missiles launched! Begin phalanx fire! No! Stop! You're firing on the docks! Missile impact 600 feet off port bow! Enemy planes at 3 o'clock! 3 o'clock from who? You're not helping us here! Blaze, Fox 2! Those... those are people floating in the waves. I shouldn't have looked. When that enemy plane crashed and covered the water in flames, there were people floating right there. 
I could see their faces. So many of them. Somebody stop this. I can't take it anymore. Kid, did you see that? So, you saw it too. Let's see. We're out of the gulf, but stay alert. The carrier's entering the ocean. Come on, whoever's out there, help us out. Get that bucket of bolts out of here. This is the captain of the aircraft carrier, Kestrel. My congratulations to all ships that managed to escape. As captain, I will now form a provisional battle fleet. The enemy's built a blockade with their fleet in front of us. We have to break through this and escape to safer waters. Good luck, everyone. All friendly aircraft, your support is requested. Blaze, this is Thunderhead. Are you clear on the mission objective? Roger. Begin the mission at once. Range to blockade line confirmed at four miles. Their formation centered around that carrier. Begin operations. This is the perfect chance to improve our battle record. Let's go. There's got to be an enemy aircraft targeting the carrier from beyond the horizon. Stay on the lookout for inbound long-range anti-ship missiles. Maintain fleet formation. We're going to break right through. I'm not going to let them sink us here. You've got to fly faster. We're going to get slaughtered. Warning. Enemy radar is tracking your every move. I'm on his tail. Fox 2! Fox 2! Please, release weapon. Phalanx at 12 o'clock low. Climb and jink! Bring all the wounded inside. We don't have time to treat them. The smoke's blocking my view ahead. I'm cutting in. Watch the phalanx fire from your right. Moving to fly cover for Captain Snow. Alpha 2, follow me! Enemy ship confirmed sunk. You don't have the skills to stay with me over this ocean. Dropping, dropping. I gotta admit, the enemy's got some great pilots. Our fighters are providing great top cover. We can do this! Captain Snow? We entrust the sky above us to you. Roger, Captain Anderson. You idiots! Do you want to die? Get out of there now! Torpedo weak! 40 degrees to starboard! Evade! Evade! Radar system back online. Surface-to-air missiles ready to launch. Enemy ship approaching the carrier's port side! Engage! Almost there! We're almost through the blockade! Our surface-to-air weapon system's finally operational. Here we go! Whoa! Where'd that shaking come from? Behind us! The top deck's been blown off! This is what we've trained for! We can do this! As long as we're still afloat, we have a fighting chance! It broke through! That's one tough boat, man! Yeah! So, kid, does it feel good to be the flight lead? I see. Good, I'm glad to hear it. This is the captain of the aircraft carrier Kestrel. Our fleet has successfully escaped to safe waters. My thanks to our brave warriors of the sea and in the air. Captain, Captain Bartlett, never returned to Sand Island.
The aircraft carrier Kestrel has survived the enemy attack and has broken through into open waters. Although the 3rd Ocean Naval Fleet sustained considerable damage, it's still combat capable. When the rescue chopper arrived, the captain was nowhere to be seen. The only thing they found was the retreating enemy intelligence vessel. This island used to be a place of exile from the rest of the world. It then became our first line of defense against the enemy. Control tower to...